Hello everyone and uh, welcome to my humble kitchen and uh, today we're gonna do some squirrel cooking and uh, we have the main star Le Chef de Dead and uh, for this we're gonna use a few things of course a cutting board some refrigerator bags I don't know if you got these over in the States and a clean sponge now we have some different kind of fruits and stuff. We got some very, very sad carrots. We got a few apples. We got a little sad lettuce, some pepper, and a, a sad banana, some fresh tomatoes. Now, since uh, red squirrels, since red squirrels are a little bit more sensitive than other squirrels in the world. This is safe for every squirrel, every kind of squirrel in the world. So uh, let's get started. Let's start with these. Uh, let's start with these uh, boring, sad carrots you often find in the bottom of your refrigerator. Uh, if they were fresh, usually we don't eat this part. Um, so cut that off, put it in, uh, in a bag, we should start with that actually. Open a bag, put it like so. But normally if they were fresh we would cut off the top, leave the green stuff on, um, they like that too. Uh, but besides from that, um, if you got some old ones, you were going to throw out anyway. Let's cut them up so they can share with their friends instead of taking a full, um, a full carrot by themselves. Now for the red pepper, let's get some fresh stuff. Use the sponge to clean it off from all kinds of pesticides and stuff like that the farmers likes to use. Like so. Uh, there is a few methods to cut these open, but this is mine. Probably not the best one. Like so. Now, we usually just eat this part and throw the top out, but cut off all the seeds because those are not good for them. Just like that. Throw the seeds out and cut this up in small pieces. In the back. Now this is ready for, for us. Now lettuce, the same thing. Wash it off. And normally, we don't eat the bottom half. So let's cut that off. And this is good for us. So we'll put that aside. And let's chop this up for the squirrel. In the back. Now this banana here, we humans tend to be a little bit picky with our bananas. We don't like discoloring and stuff like that, especially like this. So cut that piece off. Cut it in small pieces. In the back. And the rest is actually fine. There is a little discoloring there. And we all know kids, they don't like that. The rest is good. Now the peel, you actually like the insides of the peel. Uh, all these strings here, they, they actually like those a lot. So let's cut off the ends. They don't like those. Let's chop that up too. Garbage. Now, 
apples. Those are pretty important actually. Let's wash that off with a clean sponge. Like that. Uh, let me think. I'm gonna use one of these. Actually, it has a dual purpose. For some of you who don't know, you can peel with this side, and there's another function for the tip. If you put it like this, stab it in one side and the other side, and twist it. One more, maybe. But, before you throw this to the squirrels, remember to cut out the seeds. So just cut it off like that. And that. And all the seeds are in the middle, and they can eat these two just fine. Let's do that again. Wash it. And apparently I've been abandoned by Mr. Tintin. Make sure there's no seeds in there because they can eat that. It has cyanide and stuff like that inside it, so that's not so good. Out for that. Now tomatoes. The last one actually. We tend to discard off the top. Like this, right? We don't want to eat that, even though there's plenty of good stuff on there. Let's cut that up too. Like that. Now we have this little goodie bag of mixed things. And if you want to be extra nice to the squirrels outside, you can get some organic coconut oil. Grab a spoon. Good amount in there. Put it in the bag. Like that. And mix it all up. The coconut will help them uh, in the winter get extra fur and get extra thick coats. And there we go. Now, of course, don't give them everything at once. Give them a little, a, a, a little uh, at a time, so uh, birds and rats and stuff like that doesn't come and steal it all. A little bit at a time, and uh, just put the rest in the refrigerator. It doesn't matter; it's getting a little dark, a little mushy. They actually prefer it like that. So, yeah, all the things you uh, think is garbage is actually gold to them. So this is a very good goodie bag for squirrels. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Thanks for watching. Keep smiling.